Hi Simmers. Hey everyone. Welcome to Make Two and the third in our review walkthrough game playing of SimCity Build It. Now since the last time we were at my city I have, as you predicted, continued to play it. Uh, I'm continuing to advance. Uh, as you can see, uh, last time I had 97,000 population. This time I have 145,000. Uh, and I've managed to get my sims to a happiness level of 100%, which I'm incredibly proud of. Incredibly proud of. Incredibly proud of, because I worked it out. I was on level 16, and I've only gone up to level 17, because I've only been building up. You can really only get up a level by building new properties, and I've been holding off on that. But let me quickly show you what I've done to get everyone happy. The first thing I've done, I've been saving up lots of money, and I've only got 2,000 right now. What I've done is expanded all my services so that there is room to expand both north and south, east and west. So when I do want to upgrade properties, I can. So fire has got good coverage, police has coverage, health has coverage, way more than I've got now, so that I am ready to expand. Now, if you want to get to 100%, the two tips, I think you have to have every property covered by at least two special services. And the special services are ones which are parks, and every property is covered by parks. Education, not everyone is yet covered by education. And transport, where I've actually gained 47,000 in my population from transportation. Yeah, those are really tall blue bars. Yeah, I, th I think there's a limit of how tall they can get, and I think some of these properties are at their limit. Because right in the centre here, I have a helipad. I haven't seen it do anything, but that boosts the population in the surrounding area by... 50% and it has quite a big area but it costs 20 of these special keys which you collect by you know doing all sorts of things down at the docks. The only other thing I want to show you from my city just to show off is I've tried to group together buildings of a similar type all together. They all have the same name if they're the same style. So this is Tremont Towers, this is Tremont Tower, that's Tremont Tower. This is Ivory Towers, Ivory Towers, Ivory Towers. These three, I think we had one or two of these last week. We now have three. Next, we have another luxury apartment building. Looks pretty cool. And last week as well, I think we had the one with the helipad that's gone missing. Here it is, right in the middle. So I'm continuing to expand to have more of these luxury properties. All of these little ones down at the front will be luxury properties when they're built as well. Now, the other big thing I've done this week is saved up lots of um, simoleons, 60,000, in order to build this tower over here. This is Dr. View's tower, and he's going to unleash a disaster on the town. I have no idea what it's going to do, but I've been collecting these weird artifacts that you need to launch a disaster on my city. So we're going to see what happens, and hopefully it's not going to cause too much destruction, uh, or hopefully nothing that I can't repair. I want it to cause a lot of destruction. <laughs> I've made contact with alien life. They seem really unfriendly. I think they should visit. Okay, I'm going to do it. Now these things here I needed to collect over the week and just like when you collect other items that expand your city or allow you to expand your town storage, things like gears and everything. I've also been recently been offered these batteries and weird Doctor Who things, gloves and this remote control. So when you collect these, you can obviously then unleash the disasters, which I'm now going to do. You ready? Yep. Uh, wow, okay. So there's a, a UFO blasting one. Wow. Aww. <laughs> it just went right on. Uh, it's just, it's carrying, it's destroyed two buildings to rubble. Three buildings to rubble. My, and, oh, wow. Aww. Uh, <laughs> And no, no fanfare, <laughs> just, okay, but let's take a look at the damage. So there's just literally piles of rubble left. Oh my goodness. It looks like you didn't lose too many people, though. Well, population. I went from 147 to 128, so 20,000 people died. Oh, I was looking at the wrong, <laughs> I was looking at the wrong uh, number. Yeah, that's pretty mean. Hmm. So, but I can rebuild all of these. So let's see, I've got this one. It's building up pretty fast. 
I thought it, oh, I thought you were going to build from scratch. Wow. Like a phoenix from the ashes. Yeah. Wow. This is... Uh, is this a new type of building? I think this is... No, I don't think it is. Track 20. Oops. I think we've got a track 20 over there. Okay. What's interesting is it builds it in the same... Not the exact the same type, but the same level of building, because actually that should be a premium lot, but it's not a premium lot. But the other interesting thing, which I didn't notice, you, before I had 19 keys, I now have 20 keys. And if you click here, you see that you need things, and rather getting a reward of, it doesn't tell you the population, but the reward you get for this is an extra key. So that's really interesting. It doesn't give me cash anymore. It just gives me keys, which is a shame because I quite like getting cash. Okay, so I think this is... Um, yeah, this is interesting. Uh, I feel like I'm getting enough keys, but I'm not getting enough cash. So I think I'm probably going to be wary of doing these disasters again. It was cool looking, though. It was cool looking. It was cool looking. And let me see, has this changed? No other houses still give me money. It's just those ones that have been destroyed. Okay, well, that's it for this update of SimCity Build It. Next week, uh, I, I'm going to see how far I get. My next major goal is to either you know, expand out to this whole back lot here and this whole front lot here. But the next big goal is to build the airport, which takes 260,000 people. So given 20,000 people just died, I'm a bit of a way off. But that, I think, would be my next target, would be to unlock the, Tokyo, unlock the airport, which also then unlocks the Tokyo homes. That should be interesting. Yeah, so it might take me a bit more than a week to get there, but uh, hopefully I'll get there, and then I think I'm going to stop. You say that now. <laughs> I say that every time. So, ooh, those pesky exhausts are you're so rare. Okay, I hope you've enjoyed this video, and if you have, please give it a thumbs up, and let me know what you think in the comments. What do you think I should build next? More destruction, or just keep on expanding? Do let me know. And I'm going to keep on having fun and keep on bringing you these videos. So if you want to stay up to date, please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.